Well, uh, here's some breaking news. Um, so if you're if you're following kind of like the political stuff that's going on right now, we have, of course, the big forum Davos or whatever going on this week. And it's kind of like a who's who of people that uh, I wouldn't trust around my kids, people I wouldn't trust uh, to watch my dog, people I wouldn't trust to watch hermit crabs, people that uh, many people have various theories about the level of control they have over things and just really, really creepy stuff. Well, I have some kind of breaking news here. Um, if you follow my channel, you may also follow a guy named Jack Posobiec. This is somebody that I've met in real life. Very kind guy. You know, my interaction with him, very nice, um, polite, can, uh, has str strong convictions, you know, but again, I've met him for like, you know, half an hour. Um, met his brother. His brother is a nice guy. Again, in my interactions with them. Uh, and he is uh, in Switzerland uh, covering this convention. And it kind of started with what, what was interesting. Um, you know, this morning, Jack was there. He, I think he owns a company called it is a Human Events. And then um, they merged with the Post Millennial. They cover all sorts of things from a conservative perspective. And, uh, well, this just happened. I want to show you, like, the... And by the way, shout out to Savannah Hernandez. Um, I, I've got mad love for her. Uh, she's one of the kindest, smartest uh, people I've met in a long time. Balls of steel. Um, and uh, just a, a beautiful human and a beautiful uh, lady on top of that. And uh, she filmed this. So Sav says, shout out to you. Um, you'll see, let's, well, there's a couple angles here. So what we have is, Pasovic says, uh, detained at Davos. And just look at how these officers are interacting. If you're on the audio only version, you'll, you'll still be able to hear it. Uh, well, I was just waiting for They've got like five or six people armed. Um, this woman doesn't look very intimidating, neither does this man. They need to eat some cheeseburgers, I would argue. Um, Excuse me, can I ask you why you're- That's the voice of Savannah Hernandez. Detaining this journalist? Can you put the phone away, please? I it's so weird how they're like, you gotta return, take the phone down, put the phone down. Like, um, why? You don't want to be filmed doing this? Can I ask you why you're detaining this journalist? I don't answer your question. Is it uh, not, uh, we're not able to away. report here? Please put Excuse the phone me? away. Okay. Uh, can I ask you guys yeah, why you can, you're can you Yeah, can you um, please stop filming? Then we How can talk. By the way, never stop filming. Never. They don't have a right to tell you to stop filming when you're in a public space. What they want to do is they're going to say, Oh yeah, if you just stop filming, I'll tell you what, what evil stuff we're up to. And then the second you're done, you stop filming. Uh, they don't tell you anything. Uh, why do I need to stop filming? Because I asked you to. It's why do I have to stop filming? Because I asked you to. No, <laughs> that's not how it works. It's, the per it's my personal right because I don't like. No, it isn't. Like to be filmed. Okay. And it don't care. It's a right in Switzerland. Um, if I don't want to. But be can filmed. I ask why he's being detained? Then I won't point the camera at you. Then I won't film. There you go, Sav. Smart. Public property. We're not, we're, what, what's detained? Uh, can you explain? How come he's being surrounded right now? Is he uh -huh. allowed to leave the area? We're we're just um, making a normal police patrol uh, because. Oh, it looks super normal to me, right? Like it looks super normal. I mean, this is just whatever you know. A guy, a journalist, um, who's sitting there, obviously unarmed, being detained by the. Uh, World Economic Forum police. Yeah, totally normal thing for police to be doing, I'm sure. You know, it's WEF, everything is, is very Is there a reason sensitive. he specifically was targeted? Uh, there is a reason because... Oh, interesting. There is a reason. Because we, we have to have a reason to, to, to uh, so control a, a what person. what was the reason? What was he doing? I don't have to tell you that. Why, oh. why, were, why are you asking me that? Uh, because this... <laughs> because you're detaining a United States citizen uh, and a journalist. That's why she's asking you that. Savannah, yeah. I'm so proud of you.
Met met her a few times. Met her here in Milwaukee. Uh, met her down in uh, in Dallas, Texas. Just sharp as a just sharp, sharp. She's going places. This is uh, you know he's uh, there's many journalists here, and I want to yeah, know why know. he specifically is being detained. There there is a reason, but mm. uh, everything is clear now, and um, we're about to leave in just a few seconds. Thank you. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. I wonder what that reason would be. I wonder. You see here, uh, U.S. journalist Jack Posobiec has been detained by the Swiss police. They refuse to tell me the reason he has been detained. He shared uh, that police pointed uh, their weapons at him and stopped him because he, quote, looked suspicious. That's the reason? Jack, like... Jack couldn't have couldn't look more normy. Here's a, here's uh, Jack's video. Again, very first thing, what do they ask him to do? Can you stop recording? It's interesting that they are always asking about that, isn't it? Can you stop recording? Can you stop recording? Why do you think that they want to stop <clears throat> him to stop recording? Why am I not allowed to record? Please don't. Please don't. Public street? It is. But actually, I don't like it to be on a video. I can take it off. You have your document yes. on the phone. Take it off, please. Yeah. Do you want to take a picture of it? Yes. We're Keeping doing everybody safe. Drop it. Mm -hmm. Here, iPhone. You can show me, and then I can watch. What a coincidence. Am I not allowed to film? No. Why not? Not during the police conference. Bull. Bull roar. It's not allowed here. Yes, it is. In public street? Yes. Is that a law in Switzerland? Here it's not a law. I he just said here it's not a law. Please put it away. Not familiar with that law? Please put it away. It seems like you just don't want me to film. Sir, please put it away. Okay. He really shouldn't have complied there. But like, it's easy for me to say from the safety of my basement in, you know, the city and where I live. Uh, and, and it's not, I mean, it's just like, it's absolutely nuts. All right, so it's actually working. Here, front of the entrance, just like everybody else, you know, filming with the signage behind us and everything that's going on. And about an hour prior to this, while we were filming, they, you know, some officers came by and said, hey, you know, can we see your guys' passports and your press passes? We said, sure, no problem. Here you go, passports, press passes, done. Easy day, right? Or so we thought. Doing some more filming, had some live hits for The War Room, had a, my own podcast to film, and we've got another live hit coming up for the Charlie Kirk show, TP and we're at tposa.com. He's got a new great reset book and, you know, make sure we're doing all the right stuff. And so we're sitting here at this table that you could see behind me, charging the devices, um, waiting in between shots, when all of a sudden a van targeting us and, and they say, again, we need to see your passports and your press passes. And we all kind of look at each other saying, wait, I thought we already, thought we already turned all that over. So then they started asking for all this stuff again. Mm. Then they started taking us behind. All right, one by one, they started taking us behind this pile of tables. They take us behind the pile of tables. And one by one, they ask us to empty our pockets and they frisked us right behind Interesting here. stuff, They tried to it? take some of the crew away. They said, oh, let's take some of the guys away. I said, no, you're not going to be taking anybody anywhere. All right. Isn't that interesting? Wait, where do they go? They have the Wi-Fi. Hold on. <laughs> Guys got the hotspot. So they, isn't that interesting? So this is all going on when and then Kevin shows up across the street. Detain Poso. <laughs> Detain e Poso starts filming. They don't know that he's my brother because we don't look so alike. 
So he starts filming from across the street. We've got that footage. Yeah, I'm like, and who then, are these guys? And then who Why should show up than someone I haven't seen in months? People. There she is, Seth. But the Hi wonderful guys. Savannah Hernandez shows up and she starts filming and she starts getting right in the face of the detectives and the <coughs> officers. Why are you detaining them? Why are you detaining him? What's going on? So, Seth, what, what did you see from your perspective? So because Interesting stuff. Well, I'm really glad as two people that I know, um, I know Savannah a lot, a lot better than Jack, but um, this is uh, actually nuts. Uh, and I think that the the number one real uh, reason they got detained, well, I'm there, I mean, the reason they got released was because Savannah showed up and started filming them. Um, it, it's absolute insanity. These people don't want to be filmed. These people don't want to be exposed. I talked about, um, if you looked at uh, on Saturday, Avi Yemeni, another very smart person on the, on the street here, you say, I just bumped into the New York Times deputy managing editor in Davos. I asked her, how is the public supposed to trust the New York Times when they are invited guests? Well, let's look at her response. Rebecca, how are you doing from the New York Times? Can I ask you a quick question, Avi from Rebel News? How is the public meant to believe that the New York Times is here to actually ask the tough questions when you're here as an invited guest? Interesting, huh? How are people meant to rely on the mainstream media? We have, we, if you wouldn't mind, we're just That's having a, 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 just, if you could give us, you know, thank you. Uh, you don't want to explain to people why we should trust the mainstream media? No, yeah, no. it's interesting. Take a drink of your, a little another drink of your espresso. These people are all creeps. And shout out to people like Avi and Jack and Savannah for uh, putting a camera in their face because we get to bring it. I get to sit here in my basement in safety and bring it to you. Glad everyone's safe. Keep doing what you're doing. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you subscribe to this channel. Red subscribe button down below the vi uh, video. I'll bring you uh, anything else spicy that comes from this conference, and uh, I'll continue to follow these folks too.